so we because came just for you, Joey. Let's go. I'm serious. We oh, did. Man. Hell yeah. We're from Austin, let's, ATX, let's, born let's and go, raised. Man. Guys, man, hold up. Boy got up early this morning, 4.30 this morning. No alarm clock, ready to meet all you guys, man. I'm excited. Got all the homies out, you got in the house. Got Hassan. Look, you see Big Stretch over there? Let's go. <laughs> About to do the damn thing. Uh, first, you know, before any day, if you want your brain to be working correctly and you want your body to be growing, you gotta get that protein in. So we're all gonna get a balanced meal as a team, Stax Army team. And this is probably gonna be our only meal <laughs> all day until after the expo. So it's all good. Got the new merch in. And uh, by the time you're watching this, the new merch is already gonna be on the website, guys. The merch is on the website and you can go buy the new Real Recognized Real shirts with them switch blades, you know what I'm saying? You know, I keep that thing on your right here, dog. You know what I mean? With the cross switchblades and uh, the no excuses, no breaks, new design. Me and Ricky and Stretch, we put these things together like, you know, blood, sweat, and tears, man. Ricky was there with me for the beginning, and then now Stretch came with me and he helped me redesign some of the shirts. Ricky couldn't get that on video that day, but we went and did it. And, uh, you know, I think the shirts came out badass, man. So let's go get this breakfast. Let's go. Probably here in about an hour, maybe a little bit less. All right, brother, what was your name again? Jerry. Jerry? My son, Jeremy. Jeremy and Jerry. Yeah. Jerry and Jeremy. You got, oh, you got some merch though, right? Oh yeah, we got all kinds of merch, man. Cool. All right, can't wait to see y'all in there, man. All right, man. Take care, guys. <laughs> Didn't recognize the lack. Yeah, for real quick. Let's wait. go, Bobby D. There do you think? Man, I came to see. Pulled up on him. Can't go nowhere no more. Yeah. Nope. Change color in your whip, dog. I got to take my red, you paint yours black. You got to change it every week. <laughs> every week. Rabbit. Yeah, so we can't park here. But the park is right here and there's all these cars. So I'm just gonna find a spot right there somewhere and fuck around. Oh my God, is that my bodyguard? The group of my bodyguard, you guys here to protect me? I'm ready. You guys stay safe. Let me know. Thank you. Yes, sir. Bunch of mushrooms somewhere in this area. Years ago, 420. By this tree over here. Tripped out over there. Definitely, when they had, it came out with some chronic candy, I was munching that all up and down in here. This is where all the vendors are. Here in Bob Marley Fest. Before all this sidewalk and shit, this was all dirt. This was all chill grass. That's what I'm thinking, really. None of this was there. That was coming. I mean, we're talking years and years and 10 decades. Ten decades, like ten decades. Yeah, I'm probably 143. <laughs> so you want to get this pumping? Yeah, I'm on. Good. Yeah, I'm not gonna even lie to you, dude, because like, look, the workout shit was like right over. Here. Maybe we still had dude standing by the tree right there. But they used to have a dip bar. They used to have a pull up bar. It's still there. Okay, yeah, there it is. Can you see it? Oh, yeah. Nah, I mean, you just, you just gotta like ease the. Pump. The pump will come. Like no sweat pump. No sweat pump. I've had those. Y'all haven't had those? I've had those. I've never had those. I actually hate those. <laughs> kind of pumps. I know, right? I hate like, not too sure if you're really pumped. Yeah. You're like, you you like pull a muscle and shit. Yeah, you're like, am I pumped? You're not even warm, though. Exactly. You're pumped. Oh, yeah. 
was way before the big boy spot fucking. Yeah, I, yeah. I, 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 I didn't really. Yeah, we're watching it real close now. Yeah, I yeah. decided real time too, so I don't have to go hard now. Like, what was your name, bro? Jeremy. Jeremy, Jeremy. Jeremy Harmon. Nice, nice to meet you, nice bro. Yeah. We out here, baby. I stayed up super late last night. This happens to be every expo. Exhausted before the expo. And you just gotta do it. You gotta go above and beyond, put it in overdrive, and you show up and show out, and you do it for the fans, the people who support you. That's what you do it for. What's your name, bro? Ryan. Ryan? Yeah, you're fucking out the airport, bro. Hey, careful. Where are we at? Oh my God. I appreciate that. Right, that's love right there, man. Check out some merch, man. We got some uh, some new shirts. If you like it, man, cop one. If not, yeah. Yeah. Good love though. What's up, big dog? What's Stacks? Stacks. It's uh, I'm Joey Stacks. Okay. Stacks Army is kind of like my brand that I built. Basically, a hardworking motherfucker. Me and my boys, man, all started kind of like same morals, same. Same view on lifestyle, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just work hard, keep your head down, get paid. Yeah, I mean, I run my own contracting business. And I got into Instagram kind of about six, seven years ago. And uh, I was like, man, I'm trying to be one of these. Back then, they were like uh, Instagram models. And I'm like, shit, I just wanted to bring supplements, man. Yeah. So I started training. The training, I was about 170 pounds or something like that. Straight out of prison, man. I did six years. Yeah. Had a newborn son, man. I was a single dad. Yeah. So I ran a business, trained, and raised my son. Ran a business, trained. And to be honest with you, man, God changed my life, man, with my boy. Yeah. He kept me away from all the people and things that I thought was important. Yeah. So now, you know, I got three kids and one on the way. I own four businesses. It's all just from working hard, man, and yeah. changing my ways, man. You know what I mean? And yeah. Now I'm about 220. Yeah. So consistency in the gym too, and really that's the main aspect of fitness is what changed all that for me. Yeah. Because I kind of got into a new hobby, and that new hobby took a lot of my time. And I'm sure you know, bro. You know what I mean? Like at the end of the day, we go to the gym. You don't want to go and hang out with no one. You're fucking dead tired. You're gonna go home and eat. I didn't really get big until I had kids. Yeah. Because my kids is what made me go home at the end of the night to actually rest. And not drink alcohol. And not, you know what I mean? Don't get me wrong, I drink. I don't go out every night party. So I, my whole lifestyle changed just because of fitness. And it kind of built my whole brand of success. You know, now I do YouTube, which is this will be on YouTube. We've been doing YouTube about two years. We got 70K just the other day. And yeah, I got my own supplement line. I just came with shirts and stuff today, but we're based out of San Antonio. What was your name, man? Zach. Zach. Good to meet you, man. Nice to you. all from Austin? What was your name? Oh. Uh, the Austin area. Austin area. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love Austin, man. Good people here. Yeah, love the people. I grew up here for a few years. Got in a lot of trouble. That's what Austin's good for. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Zach, it's good to meet you, man. That's how we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I recognize you, man. Yeah, how you doing? Birthday weekend, coming. Yeah, I appreciate the love, dog. He came out on his birthday weekend. That's the love right there. That's my little girl. Hi, how are you? Joey, nice to meet you. What's your name? Bonnie. Bonnie. Bonnie, Bonnie Jay. Hey, I made this little shirt. Let's <laughs> go. Oh, I like that. Hi, nice to meet you. Joey, nice to meet you. Let's go. I like that shirt. Something real friend, I made it to come on here. Yeah, that's cool. You know what's funny is, the fist was something I was actually gonna put on one of my next shirts. And she has it on this shirt right there. That's like a sign from God right there. It's like I need to make the shirt with the fist. Shout out to Bonnie, huh? Yeah, we're back. Let's go! I love that shirt, dude. That's awesome. Kill it. Huh? And it's wearing on You know what? I got back into it. I told my boy, I'm like, we only get older, brother, and we want to be looking younger. Look at all y'all's videos, the big guy out here. Can you see the transformation? Can you hear that eye? You're going to work it, bro. Jeff. Get up in here, buddy. Come on, man. Stacks on me. Come on. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, they have their fun, but like, 
Coming out of, he had about four or five years of experience at the yeah. time, and he was like, "Hey, man, you know, I want to do some work on you, you know, because you know, as an Instagram influencer, he kind of wanted to swap networking, you know." And I'm like, "Hell no! Nah. I'm not letting another dude rub on me, you know." Like a lot of people are like, "Nah, nah." I told him I was gonna have surgery on my shoulder to kind of like, it was true, yeah. But I was also trying to push him away so he stopped asking me to work. He's like, "Oh, surgery." Where do you gotta have surgery at? And I'm like, oh man, it's inside. I'm like, it's deep in there. He's all, it's right here. Dude. And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, come here real quick. And he fucking touches a, a what is what is it, Jerry? Is that a muscle? Yeah, it's a muscle in your subscapularia. Subscapula. Bro, told me, good God, I would have. Like, oh. Bro, I was like, no, I couldn't, I couldn't move. And all that pain and all the shit the doctors were telling me I needed surgery on went away, bro. Wow. He was like, grab a dumbbell. I couldn't even lift the dumbbell. I grabbed it and started lifting it right after. And he got back in there a little bit more. Next thing you know, I was like, bro, I gotta see you, bro. So you were listening to that stuff, I need surgery, and you're like, oh, no, no, you don't need all that. He like, does no, that to people all the time. Now like, I, I, yeah, yeah. Hey, now I do that to people. I'm like, you don't need surgery. <laughs> you don't need all that. But yeah, if you're in the San Antonio, you're from Austin, right? Houston. Oh, no, okay. actually, like an hour south of Houston on the coast, in between like Galveston and Corpus. Okay, but I was I was in the Austin area. I came actually to visit friends and watch a pool tournament. But I was watching your video and you said you were gonna be here uh, September third. So I'm Check like, oh yeah. yeah, my man. It's good to meet all yeah. you guys. Likewise, brother. Right. Take care, big dog. Pretty good, here. Oh yeah, I'm the one that was out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, boy, what's up, big dog? He's like, I mean. I'm too small. <laughs> hey, we're all different stages, bro. Come on in here, man. Uh, I would say I used to be a bigger dude. Yeah, yeah. I wanna, you know, you get that, you get that way, you help push weight, bro. Keep on training every day. Occupy your free time with the training, man, because if you start now, Later on, when everybody starts, you're already be way more advanced and way more above everybody. Yeah, you're young and you're ready. It's about the perfect time, bro. How old are you? I'm 23. 23. Shit, you're young and you're ready then. <laughs> I, was, I was 17 when I started. But not because I wanted to. <laughs> because I had to. He was like 250-something pounds. And I mean, he was like, plus his type 1 diabetes. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, you got to watch that. So now, man, he dropped dramatically. I mean, his like... Of course. But, uh, How are you gonna live a lot longer too, man? Yeah, and I was, I started 
probably about like four years ago. And I was I was 240 pounds, but like bad way. Bad. bad way. Right now I'm 250. Trans to a point chest and shoulders, baby. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. But now man, I was like, man, I gotta be sick. Yeah, man. So, yo, from Austin, right? No, from Houston. Oh, y'all getting down from Houston. Yeah. So, so I, had, I had seen that you had posted it. I said it ahead. Man, we gotta go. We gotta go. Did y'all try to go to the American State or no? No. Oh, because yeah, I didn't get in there. So, so that's what I like, man. I'll be watching YouTube because I mean, I'll be at work at 2 o'clock in the morning. Oh, shit. So I'll be working and go there on my desk and people putting you on and just go through the video. Yeah, and I'll be yeah, like, yeah. Hey, that's man. love right there. Watching me at work, you're supposed to be working. Yeah. <laughs> hey, this is quality right here. Literally quality. And uh, I'm 250, this is a size large, so. Yeah, let's that's go. Right. We're giving them some views. Yeah. yeah. This is comfortable right here, man. Yeah, man, I tried to do it right the first time. I tried to get my brand out there, but I also want good quality. So if I sell less for a more expensive but better quality, that's what it is, you know what I mean? Do you think about ever come out with like lanyards or like, like what about like, Shorts, oh yeah, like definitely that. gonna have shorts. We're gonna switch it up. Like this uh, winter, I'm gonna be having like a hoodie jumpsuit. I'll get some badass jackets. I got some gym bags I'm making right now. What? Supplements are coming. That's the a weird, movie, man. Like, so the supplements are gonna be phenomenal, bro. I'm talking like quality stuff, not some white label bullshit. Yeah. And somebody came up like I sat down with somebody who knows their shit because I don't want my people taking shit that's not gonna do nothing. Yeah. Over caffeinated, over, you know, all this shit that's bad for you. I don't want my people to do that. Yeah. I want my people to have shit that's good for you and get you results. Yeah. So I'm spending way more money than what any people would normally spend on a first time supplement. It's like, Man. just to make the money? Nah, it's not about just making the money, bro. It's like, I want people to be like, damn, I can feel the free workout. I can yeah. see the yeah. BCAAs helping my body recover. You know what I mean? Like, that's what it's about for me. Yeah. I can change the, per the world one person at a time by helping one person. And I started that eight years ago. Now I help thousands of people. Maybe even the hundreds of thousands. I don't know. Yeah. Around the world, you know what I mean? I mean, we got people in New Zealand, Australia, Canada, UK. I mean, you know, all over Europe. I mean, it's amazing. And that's what my boys see too, you know? Like, they started on a smaller scale. And I'm telling you, man, just keep going. Yeah. It doesn't matter, you might bring inspire somebody you don't even realize. Mm -hmm. This young man here inspires somebody. I went from 250 pounds to, what do you want, wait, wait, no. 163. 163. See? He's gonna get his weight up, but he's gonna turn it into muscle <laughs> this time, dog. Yeah, man. That's cool, man. Hell yeah, guys. Man, I like, I like y'all's vibe, man. Yeah, yeah. I y'all just, like you know, I see how you, you take care of your people, and, I mean, you show it. You know what I mean? That's what it's about, big dog, like I said. It's, I'm gonna ride to the top because I'm doing everything for the right reason, you know what I mean? Yeah. You'll be called out later on if you get caught, you know what I mean? It's <laughs> yeah. the way it is. Oh, yeah. Appreciate it. Good to meet you, oh, hey, they call you, they don't call you stressed for no reason, huh? <laughs> What's up, baby? How you doing, my man? Nice to meet you. What's your name? Felipe. What's up, big dog? What's your name? Alberto. Alberto and Felipe. What's up, big dog? How y'all doing, man? Yeah, I'm good. Just don't well, you're the bigger one. Let's get big. Gummies, man. They're good, man. They work. Yeah. Yeah. 
Mr. Shipper? No, I'm, I'm an actor. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah, homie. What was your name? Ox. Ox? Yeah, I just happened to be Ox. You had to be Ox and they were like, shit, yeah. we need you. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. yeah. I'll take up there in SA. Oh, good, bro, good. Just yeah. grinding. Yeah. Making that money. Yeah. Working in that heat, staying tan. Yeah. You know sir, what I'm saying? Sir. Hey, my respect on the big boy stuff, too. Yeah, hell yeah. Appreciate I support you. I'm done with that. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Thanks, bro. I appreciate it. Hey, yeah, just keeping it real, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't like big ass people. Yeah, I don't like that. You know, just you work a full time job and you're doing, yeah, uh, yeah. doing the preps and stuff or the competition and shit. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Not anymore, but I'm retired now. Yeah, no, I'm talking about me. I'm talking about oh, yeah, so what you, you do. Work working a full time job yeah. and then still putting in the gym work. Of course. And the yeah. YouTube stuff and then. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, major respect, bro. No yeah, we got our own shit coming. What are these drinks, actually? I was going to ask you about those. It's a, it's a CBD infused drinks, recovery drinks. The owner knows everything about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I was talking with her earlier. Yeah, what's up, what's up? How are you? Good, Welcome good. back, sir. Yeah, I was just telling you about CBD and I take it already. And yeah. I take it like I have one that's like a nighttime. You know, so I crash out. And honestly, I can tell the difference between when I take it and then I go like two, three weeks without it. Yeah, that's the bedtime. Because the CBN is one that backdoors the receptors and causes drowsiness and helps you sleep. Yeah. Without having to do a lot of I THC type stuff. Because some people, like myself, feel a little hungover on THC in the morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some people feel phenomenal. Of course. And so we want to be able to have yeah, both that. avenues. Yeah, no, no, most definitely. And I can tell too when I eat too many gummies. Come on. Uh, well, that's the hard thing about edibles. They yeah, taste so good. For sure. So then, you know. I like these eat. edibles better than the THC ones, so. though. Yeah. THC ones are too much, bro. Well, this right here is what we put THC and caffeine together. Oh, because okay. if you're somebody like me that's slightly sensitive to THC, when you add caffeine to it, a light stimulant to it, Let's then go. it makes me happy and it's golden. Like a, Sugar-free Red Bull and smoke it. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> so you would do all this at one time? No, just one. It's a two-ounce shot. Okay. And so the green ones are 30, like 35 milligrams, and then 30 milligrams of caffeine. In the drinks, I now started making CBD and energy. We also do THC and caffeine shots. I always shots. worry about drinks, so so I always got a weird taste. Like, and not saying these do, but like, you ever had like a? And you can bleep these names out. All those like they remind me of detox. Well, they're adding filler to it. We take everything into like a distillate form or nano emulsification form. We basically take them into powders and blend it with high quality drinks. I can take a regular sweet tea my grandmother would make and mix it in there, and that's the difference between ours and other people. Because we're licensed hemp farmers here in the state of Texas, I can take a lot of different cannabis CBG, CBC. You know what I mean? Other cannabinoids. Because the fascia, muscle fascia is so thick that you've got to be able to put it in for inflammation. But Most definitely. just so you know. This is there. cool though, you have a lot of lot to choose from. Scientifically. I don't think I've ever seen a drink. We're coming either. to San Antonio. Really? We're coming to some gyms in San Antonio, so oh, I've okay. got a meeting there. Where are you based out of? We're based out of Austin. Okay, cool. Yeah. Good to see you. Hot. Right there, Zach. Good to meet you. We're done, man. Good to meet you. Already. all that together, got a stacks. Alright, alright guys. How about any of your friends? What's wrong? Get it, boy. Get your money. 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 She got that grip. She wants to find out where you're at, dude. That's a good grip, right? She hurt my grip. She's right out of the room. You got it, you got it. Sorry. I let down. should have flipped up over the table. Yeah, I was thinking that. It's all techniques. Yeah, so that's how. Nice to meet you. Same here, guys. Have a blessed day. You too. Hold up. What's up, baby? Yeah, I'm tired of myself, bro. Oh, hell yeah. That's how 
I built my brand, bro. My boys, and they, they just started rolling with me since I started my own thing. So we've been just training partners and homies. And once I started this going, I'm like, shit, who's better than to have than one of my best boys and my homie I've been having for 10, 12 years now. Now real recognize real, baby. You already know. I'm with it, man. My man, JP, I fuck with y'all, dog. Good to meet y'all, man. Nice to meet you, man. Good to meet y'all, G. How you doing, man?
<laughs> and they're all going and finding me. Like, where the hell is Joey? Like, look at me, looking for me. They're messaging these guys. And they're like, nah, man, this page is banned. And then I'm going on my YouTube and tell them stacks.army now, not joey.stacks. But yeah. well, when I get the page back, because I will, you know, obviously everything's going to keep going. Yeah. YouTube's growing, though. Yeah, it's, it's getting up there it's now. I get all the love. Too. I look at the, you know, it says when you come at the views, the, the views are going up, too. Yeah, hell yeah. Hey, did you know the caddy up or what? I didn't I did. the whole thing, but. So I didn't blow it up. We were actually at the house, and I made a phone call to the mechanic just to talk to him. And he's like, bro, I got some bad news. And I'm like, what? He's like, I don't know what happened. I just got here. And your whole car caught fire on the photo. And I'm Damn. like, what? And I'm like, I'm coming out there right now. <laughs> One good reaction so far. I saw that guy right now. Yeah. 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 I'm going to start going up to like while they're competing, like while they're fighting and shit, and like ask, are you daddy? <laughs> they're like, get the fuck away from me. <laughs> hey, but real shit though, they're probably moving back to Cali soon, so we got to get that workout in before you go back. Oh shit, wait, are you here? Where are you I live here right now. Okay, you got messed up or something, right? Which one? The one with the straight dark tail, like the audio? The big boy video, yeah. yeah. Bro, we went to the Cheesecake Factory, everybody was running out of there. So I'm like, I need change dog, I'm trying to get down dog, like uh. <laughs> You acting like big boy? Yeah. <laughs> Bro, it was so good, I'm so pissed. Bro, I called the company, it's only the second time they ever had that happen. The audio just like, no explanation, it just goes away. Yeah. Big Boy was really playing, he was like, <laughs> you're making fun of me. You're ruining my whole image, it's a lie. Yeah, he got lucky with that one, that I lost the audio. Yeah, he did, he definitely did. We work in the heat all day. Wait, really? Yeah. I thought you were the owner. Oh, I am. Yeah. And I also work. Oh, damn. Yeah, yeah. so if my man's out there and he's dying, I ain't gonna let him stay out there by himself. So sometimes we got guys that are willing to come to work. Some guys, sometimes guys that are willing to work don't even show up. So also contracts, schedule a day for that. You know, I'll be out there with him digging holes like a motherfucker, dog. You know what I mean? To me, I feel like it's whatever God calls you to do that day. If he says sit at your desk and work all day at your laptop, I'm doing that shit. I'm like, Ricky. Let's go, we're going. And he hates it too. Yeah. <laughs> he's got to be out in the heat all day with us, you know? Yeah. So it's cool though, man. It's a blessing to be able to know the trades and continue to build businesses. Because that's how I built my first business. It's all by myself, learning about taxes, learning about how I got more companies. Your yeah. boy Stacks is doing solar around the nation. So if you need solar, you let me know. For sure, man. Let's go. Cool. <laughs> oh, man, it's good to see you, brother. We're going to get a workout in, though, for sure. We have to. <laughs> All right, guys. Y'all go follow my boy Eric. Let's show some love. Real, recognize real. Yeah, I love that. I do all my people would love that with the switch blade. I mean, yeah. Let's go. I got one around yet? Look at everything. Yeah, we got here. Got here. Yeah. 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 Straight to stacks. Yeah, we got some busy birds. That's right. That's right. We're hey, you got your gold mark. I know you do. Somewhere. Oh, yeah. Right there. Yeah. 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 I'm so mad at myself, see? We've been talking about that, yeah. I was like, I'm gonna beat my own. It's my first expo. Yeah. I forgot my name. I got like a whole drawer full of them. It wasn't meant to be. Yeah. Or else it would have been. Swear it next time, you know. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna have another one. Oh, yeah. yeah. We're gonna be doing, yeah, we're gonna be doing them more. You know, I'm gonna try to be networking with people. Yeah, I'm good, yeah. Yeah. I can't even get the merch. I'm gonna get the chance. Come over here, get out of the hallway. Who gave me this market? Ah, oh, yeah, you missed it. Hold on, Dad. I'm gonna let you call at it real quick. Who is this? That's my son, Johnny. What's up, my dog? I see you, homie. Oh. Where you at? Let's go. Let's go. Hey, baby. Hey, if I show you couldn't make it, yeah, hey, responsibility is not good though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take care of that business. Got you one. Don't worry about it, baby. Hey, I autographed it for you too, big dog. I got you one. Let's go. Appreciate the love, homie. Look, we got all the homies out here, dog. Yeah. Hey, What's up, baby? We got Ricky in the house. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Rick. Got yeah. big stretch. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you're a big motherfucker, too, dog. You're a big boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that last egg, folks. 
I told, I was telling people from work, you know, everybody watches the beef and what they follow. And I told them, I said, dang, I said, I don't know if I should take it as a compliment. I said, Joe said he stabbed me too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I tell people growing up, I said, when I was growing up, I said, it was never a one-on-one. -on -one. I always got jumped growing up. And it was like, dang, Where, where was all these people at with this jumping and fair and all that yeah. back then? Same shit with me too though, homie. Like, since I was a kid, I was always this big. Yeah. So everywhere I went in my neighborhood, I, homie, I couldn't get a knife. As a kid, I would take a steak knife and put that <laughs> hole in my sock. In my neighborhood, yeah. you roll around on bikes and shit, bigger kids try to punk you, take your shit. Yeah. But, homie, I was stacked, so, homie. I was a little kid. What's up? What y'all want to do? And sure enough, just like it scared big girl away, it scared all them other guys away. Yeah, absolutely. You know what I mean? It's like, you are you, you really about it? Because I'm really about it. Yeah. And if no, you're not, okay, then shut the fuck up, yeah, and we'll go on about our way. I got guns mean? pulled on me before, and I'm like, what the fuck that mean, homie? You think I give a fuck? You're going to use yeah. that mother? Because yeah. I'm so ready and amped. I don't think about my repercussions. I've been held a gun for trying to get robbed. And I'm like, I'm not giving you shit. I mean, they could have just killed me. Yeah. But here I'm like, fuck you. I ain't, getting, you ain't, getting, I ain't got no money anyway, bitch. Like, yeah. You know? And then they're like, fuck, I don't want to argue. I don't want to kill you. Shit. Oh, fuck, get out of here. I know. Big man. His last video, he had all the guys you mentioned in your video. And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, oh, yeah. Yeah, because we're all still friends. And we all have the same thing in common. Fuck Big Girl because he's a hater and he never wants to see anybody do good. And he'll be, he'll betray you, stab you in the back. I mean, the main reason me and him bump heads first was because he stole thirty five hundred dollars. You ain't got that much of words who you are. So don't be trying to, you know, first of all, insult my manhood. Then you want to try to be like, yeah, you a big ass too. Hell yeah. I got something for big dudes, you know? And, and that's just what it is. And obviously, I was bigger than he was that day. He didn't want to do nothing. Appreciate it. Let me get one more pick. Yeah, yeah, let's get one. So me and you in there? Yeah. Let's go. Johnny. And you about to get Ricky in the gym, man. He goes. He just works yeah. a lot. Ah. He wants to make that money right now. Ah, he's trying to stack that paper. Yeah, he works for me. And then he also runs another company on the side, his business. Him and his girlfriend, and then he works more than just with me full time. He does another for other people. You know what I mean? So yeah, and I always like, thought that's all he did. That's why I was like, well, man, I can't he did in the beginning, but then you know, obviously, I'm not like big girl. I want the best for my people, so I'm like, shit, take a day off. This guy's gonna pay you this much. I'm even telling him like, nah, nah, nah. You need to do this, this, this. Charge for it. Because I want to see my boy succeed. I don't want him to be held back when he can do more. And I'm going to make him do it. Oh. If I have any questions, I go to him. Yeah, no, most of them. It's all love, baby. Good to see you, homie. Likewise, Love likewise. You, Appreciate y'all. Hey, Dress is solid. That's my boy right there. That's my ride right there. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? All right, Johnny. What's up, baby? All right, Johnny. Hey, hell yeah. Hey, you mind if I get a picture with you guys? Yeah, hell yeah. You doing what you're doing, cuz. You're doing good, cuz. You're doing really good. You got the look, man. You got the look. You know what I'm saying? Look the part. You got to look the part, right? You got to be on. You know what I'm saying? Like that. So you got to win the support, cuz. I'm out here for you, cuz. Good to meet you guys. My man, hell yeah. Good to meet you guys. Hey, if y'all ever come out to here in Austin, work out at Lit Bay Yeah, Lit Bay. Oh, yeah. We're supposed to go there. Yeah, that's what I'm at. I just hit 405 on the bench, cuz. And I just hit 500 on the squat. Okay, yeah, yeah. Ben Flores on Instagram. Ah, oh, shit, trying to shout my shit out. <laughs> <laughs> you good. Hey, appreciate you guys. Nice to meet you guys. We'll see you later, bro. What's up, baby? Thanks, boy. Hey, Antonio. Represent, baby. Y'all came all the way out of it. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. I love that when you went, when y'all went to go check Big Boy. Yeah, hell yeah. Hey, busting, real recognized, real dog. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we both made a lot of money. I just told him, hey, man. I thought about sending him a text message because he's got my number. I got his. You're welcome for all that money I just made you shitty channel.
What? You gonna have big muscles one day? Yeah. You're a beauty. <laughs> oh yeah, you wanna get a pig? You gotta look big. Let's go! I appreciate the love, bro. So you said I look bigger in person? Yeah, way bigger. In person, I look bigger, y'all. Watch out. Yeah. Thank you, bro. I watched you. Oh, David. David. I watched your YouTube video. Thank you, bro. Hell yeah. I work outside too, bro. I feel your pain. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. No excuses, no breaks. No, no excuses, no breaks. Thank you, David, right? Yeah, David. Thank you, bro. 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 I worked out, I had a kid, I was a dad, 
and I made no excuses. I took some breaks. <laughs> Once I started seeing people like, man, hell yeah, this is, that made me want it more. Because uh, now I'm starting to help change people's lives. And if I quit, I feel like I'm going to let a lot of people down. These people help build me who I am today. So I can't let it down. Exactly. Got to keep grinding. Yeah, keep your head down. Go to work. Go to the gym. Go home. Go to bed. Yeah, I'm in St. Marcus. Close. Uh, if, you, uh, if you ever pass through St. Marcus, I want to invite you down to Smack. It's the oldest gym here in Texas. Smack. Smack. It's downtown St. Marcus. It's an old school gym. Different atmosphere. Different energy levels. Yeah, yeah. Get in there. Yeah, that's what I like doing. You know, it's kind of going out. I feel out. like every gym you go to, it's, it's like you always get a good pump that first time. Yeah, you go. yeah. It's different. Yeah. feeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Energy level. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, brother. But yeah, I just want to just come show some love. I'm going to buy some merch right now. Yeah, you get a picture too. I'm yeah, yeah, definitely. Get a picture. What size are you? You got all different types, man. Okay, yeah. I'm going to probably look around and see what I can get. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I see, yeah. That's a good version. He's done, man. Yeah. You know what? I got some for you. You've been so much of an influence. I was like, you know what? Let me just bring you something. I give. Say thanks. Just a little token. My appreciation to you. But you've done for me in my line. Okay. So it's got an actual. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Get that stacks on the dog tag. Oh yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, take care of yourself. We'll link up again soon. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Thanks, Army Dog Tag, baby. I'm gonna have to get it dipped in gold now. I was just thinking that. Hey, I got people that do it. Stone Cold, man, he was a growing up, he was a real 
huge inspiration in my life, right? And then he became a friend of mine. Oh, wow. And then I got to feed his dogs growing up. And then he, he gave me birthday presents all the way until I was about 15 years old. Oh, cool. So it's pretty cool, man. And then I got to meet my... You save any of his stuff or what? Uh, yeah, I have a whole blue trunk full of autograph shit from him. Yeah, hell yeah. One day when he dies, it'll be worth money. Sorry, big dog. It won't be worth money. It'll be like, oh, cool. yeah, it's always oh, like that. Kidding. It's always like that, yeah, though. You yeah, she was really good at saying that. about 15, 20 years. I mean, let's hope it's later than that. All yeah. right, Steve, I'm giving you as many years as you can get. <laughs> yeah, he's a good dude, though, man. He's, he actually, when I met him... Where'd you meet him at? Like, in Bernie, Texas. Okay. I'm from San Antonio. Okay. And my mom lived out there. We actually moved, like, seven houses down from the person who was his taxidermist. Oh, wow. So you know that white motherfucker let her hunt like a son, bitch. So he was taxing all kinds of shit. You know shit. The, uh, the Liver King? Uh, I, I he, don't know him. I know he grew up in San Antonio. I didn't know that until like. So I didn't know the Liver King grew up in San Antonio. I didn't know he was in San Antonio. Really? Yes. And that got motherfucker owes me a YouTube video then. <laughs> <laughs> the same city, Liver yeah, King. Okay. Where you at, Liver because King? I heard you got bullied and he used to go to San Antonio. So I'm like, oh shit, he was in uh, San Antonio. No. You should have hung out with me more. I never let people bully me. I always pulled out a blade on that yeah. ass. I was small, but. You know, Joey Stacks, S-T-A-X. I heard of that. I, uh, you heard of me? Well, I, heard, I heard that term, you know, but I didn't, I didn't. It is a term in every household around America these days. <laughs> Joey Stacks. We got kids out here. What's up, baby? S-T-A-X. Okay. Yeah, that's what we got. We got one more and no more. One more. Good game, G. Hey, yo. I just do an later. I said it. I said it. All right, I got you. Yeah. There you go. Okay, we're okay. Let's go. Hey, that's a wrap, baby. Another day in the life with your boy Joey Stacks. Had an awesome time, guys. The Austin Fit Fest. Amazing group of people. Uh, man, the energy was amazing. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my boy over at Big Tex, Rob, and his wife Esther. Awesome people. Can't wait to do it again next year, guys. So prepare your schedule for the Austin Fit Fest next year. It's going to be a huge event. Turned out to be great this year. We were pretty busy the whole time, right, Rick? Yeah, we were going. I mean, I ain't going to lie. Like, any minute that I got to sit down or enjoy some time, not away from you guys, but just... You know, just sit back, have some sips on my uh, drink, and get water, and no food, and I haven't eaten all day, guys. I'm like delirious right now. The only thing I've had was breakfast, pretty big breakfast, uh, and about six Crown and Cokes at the fight. <laughs> I had a couple energy drinks and uh, one cookie. Shout out to my people over there at Top Secret Cookie. You know what I'm saying? Great people, love their vibe, love their cookies, Ricky. Did you get to try one of those? Yeah, them took a You fine. did? Yeah. You sneaked one? I didn't even see you, dog. Yeah, yeah. it's a little sneaky sometimes. Yeah, it's like the, you bought the whole cookie? No. Huh? no oh, okay, you just had some? Okay. Yeah, yeah but bomb-ass cookies. Man, I always love expos, guys. I always love meeting everybody, getting to shake the hands of the people who support me and show love and uh, hear your stories and hear how I motivate and inspire you, man. That reminds your boy of why he's doing what he's doing. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to go. I'm going to end it. I don't even know how I'm going to end it, but I'm just so hungry right now, guys. I'm going to go ahead and go get some food. Ricky's going to go back to his girl and his family. Uh, and, uh, yeah, that's a wrap. But if you ain't ready, you better get ready. Stack subs are coming soon. No excuses, no breaks. The pre-workout BCAAs. If you haven't yet, go to StacksArmy.com. Copy some of that Stacks Army merch. Don't be looking for a tank top because they ain't got them, guys. They just cut the sleeves off. I make it look good, baby. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate the love and support. Go cop some of that merch. Let's go. Bye. Too gross, so like yeah. fitness. Okay, I, I can see that. Yeah. that Biggest fuck. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. So I do uh, fitness content, and yeah. uh, I've been doing YouTube about two years. Okay. There's a big fitness expo here today, the Austin Fit Fest. Oh, really? Yeah, it's pretty okay. dope, though. Yeah, yeah. What's up, big dog? I'm not sure. Yeah, we all from? Uh, I'm from Michigan, fucking Michigan. Little Louisiana right now. Okay, cool. You guys here to party or what? Basically, yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I guess saw it. I'm like, okay, only got, that was when I asked. Yeah, what's yeah. your name? Lorenzo, man. Lorenzo Stacks. Stacks? Joey Stacks. I'm Jamal. What's up, big guys? Hey, yeah, appreciate the love, though. Yeah, yeah man. Check me out on YouTube, bro. So, what's the channel, man? Uh, Joey Stacks. Joey Stacks? Right, S T A X. S T A X. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm only, I'm from San Antonio. I'm about an hour away that. from here. But yeah, we came out. I got a bunch of my people here with me and shit. And yeah. my video guy, my boy yeah. Ricky. Yeah. And uh, we're just out here motivating, man. Showing love, trying to inspire and motivate people. No, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Hard work pays off, baby. It absolutely does. Already. Yeah. All right, Lorenzo, what were yeah. you saying your name was again? Jamal. Jamal. Have a good night, All right, boss. You I'll see y'all around. Okay. Joey Stacks, S-T-A-X. Yes, Take care, Lorenzo. All right, Rick.